Let's get ready for Coachella. I hope I didn't accidentally buy two. I'm trying to play it cool, but I'm actually a little bit stressed about that. Ooh, my boots are here. I am so burnt. I'm so upset. Hello. Hello, you guys, and welcome to or back to my YouTube channel. I am very excited about this video because we are getting ready to go to Coachella. I've never been. I literally live in LA. I'm a drive away, don't even have to fly, and I've had tickets the last two years in a row, and every time just told my boyfriend to end up selling them because just wasn't really interested. If you know me, like Coachella's probably not really my thing. I've never been to a festival, and I'm just not much of a partier. I don't drink, I don't do drugs, I don't do anything like that, and I'm just a very busy, busy girl, so this year we weren't gonna go. I wasn't like super impressed with the lineup and I was just a little stressed out because I have a lot going on. But then I was like, you know what? I'm young. Like I said, I'm in driving distance. We already had tickets and I need to just get over myself and go. So we decided on Saturday, just three days ago that we were gonna go to Coachella and people plan their outfits all year long. I'm not a fashion girly. So if you're watching this because you want inspo, no promises. I'm not a fashion girly. I don't know anything about Coachella and what you're supposed to look like. All I know is like what I've seen on Instagram. People either go like boho or they go like super sexy barely wearing anything and maybe there's something in the middle. But I am not a type of person that pulls off like a sexy look in my opinion. Don't got all the facilities for that. So we're going more of like a boho country look is kind of the goal. So I ordered a bunch of random pieces like overnighted. Some of this stuff arrived today and then the rest of it is arriving tomorrow for the most part. And then I have one last package arriving on Thursday, the day we leave. So we're gonna hope for the best. I am going to try pieces on though as they come because if I wait till Thursday when all the boxes get here and I'm like about to leave to Coachella, it's gonna stress me out. So I'm gonna try on some of these pieces. They're not exactly like the matching outfits but we're just gonna see how the things look, unbox them and everything. And then as boxes arrive, I will keep unboxing them with you guys and show you what shows up. And then on Thursday, we will finalize the final outfits, how I'm gonna pair everything and what I'm gonna pack. So I don't know if that makes sense. You probably just wanna see me put the outfits together, but we're going through this together. So let's get ready for Coachella. So the first package that we have is from Princess Polly. I have ordered some stuff from there before. Also kind of what I had in mind is I just ordered a ton of stuff, like so many options. And then I'm just gonna return everything that I end up not wanting to bring with me. I'm gonna like return everything before I leave. I wasn't gonna take my outfits too seriously, but today I had a meeting with Snapchat because not only is it my first Coachella, but it's also my first year being like a creator and getting to be on like the inside scoop of some things. And we're gonna be going to like the Neon Carnival and the Celsius event and things like that. So I also got to have a meeting with Snapchat to talk about my strategy for Coachella and how I can like grow my audience and get monetized while I'm there. And like, basically I'm supposed to be posting like 200 pictures a day while I'm at Coachella. So that really made me like be like, shoot, I need to take these outfits way more seriously than I was planning. So let's just open her up and see what we've got. First is a white mini dress. Next, we have a Nelly mini dress in leopard. Another thing is I did not really look at the size charts for all these different websites, so that's a little worrisome. It's possible many things won't fit. We have the butterfly galore top in beige. The lose it strapless white top grayer top in white delilah top in white princess polly was like one of the last stores i ordered from because i realized i ordered a bunch of bottoms and skirts and stuff and i was like i have no tops to go with these and lastly we got a bunch of jewelry another thing that i saw from all the outfit inspo that i looked at for coachella is just even if your outfit's kind of mid like they just layer jewelry and then it looks good. And I'm not a big accessorizer, but we're gonna work on that. Next we have a box from Urban Outfitters. I have like four boxes from them, so I have no idea what this little one is. All right, some accessories it looks like. We have a bunch of jewelry and accessories. Don't even remember what that could be. We have a belt, a little country, country belt moment. 
The good thing is I also really like my favorite music is country music. I do love a good country moment. So hopefully I can wear some of these things again in the future. And then we have a Charlie ruffled something, maybe a shirt. I ordered these yesterday and I already don't remember. Next we have a big box from Urban Outfitters again. Okay. We've got a cowgirl hat. <laughs> I think I got two of those. Okay, pink shirt. I do remember these items. I just don't remember what's from what store. Um, Maria embellished top. Something white. A mini skirt. I'm like so not a skirt person in my daily life, so I'm excited. A green mini skirt. Just, what is this thing? A cream like mini short. Oh shoot. Wait a second. Was this their mistake? I hope I didn't accidentally buy two. I hope they just sent me two. This is the Ryder cowboy hat in black. And I have two. And that is lit, unless I paid for two. The final box that we have so far is another big Urban Outfitters box. Mind you, like I said, we still have... I think I have at least three more stores that I'm waiting on stuff from. So that stuff should be arriving tomorrow. I ordered stuff from 12th Tribe. Dolls, oh, this is 12th Tribe. This box is 12th Tribe. 12th Tribe. Dolls Kill, Jaded London, and like a swimsuit company that makes like these cute wraps. You'll see it when I get it. Also, I saw that my 12th Tribe order was split into two packages. So there's more to come. We have one of those jingly belts in red to match my red cowgirl hat. We have something black. I think it's a skirt. Okay, these don't have names. A black mesh something. Oh, my boots are here. And we have two pairs. You guys. These are so cute. I know that like boots might not be smart because how do you break them in and stuff before you go? But my friend Emma gave me a little hack to like put your sneakers insoles in boots and they'll be comfortable. But I also ordered some Dr. Scholl's insoles and these like heel covers. So we got brown boots those are so cute god i hope they fit and then we've got some earrings some little cowgirlish some more boots guess what color red to match my red hat oh my god i hope these look good <laughs> might look terrible in these but we got some red cowgirl boots too yeah that's definitely not everything i ordered from that store i'm waiting on a ton more so this is just the front half of it so let's go ahead and try some of these pieces on Let's see what we can do. Okay, I just spent like literally 30 minutes just taking the plastic off of all the pieces and laying them out so I could see what I have. And this is what we're left with. So I have jewelry like all along here, hats, boots, and clothes. I'm so excited. I can't believe this isn't all of it. So now that I have everything laid out, I think that there are certain pieces that I need to like pair with these that I don't have right now. So I will show you guys when the next boxes come and then when we open all those up, then we'll start trying them on. It may be a few days later, but we are back with lots of updates. I have received packages over the last couple days and I've been gathering what we're gonna bring to Coachella and what we're not, but it's been a little bit hard to unbox every single thing on camera because I'm posting a ton of content on this trip on Snapchat because I am a Snapchat creator and I get to post on their story. And I'm also trying to unbox things for TikToks, so we have to find a balance. But I have some outfits picked out that I'm going to show you guys. And then I have some pieces here still that have not really found their outfit. And just got another package in the mail. So we're going to go ahead and open these. And I'm just going to show you everything we're working with. This is from Jaded London, which I've never ordered from. They have a little bit of like tea online because somebody got a piece from Jaded Love London and it had a Shein tag on it. I'm pretty sure that was a story, but we'll see. Now, listen, I ordered this before I learned my lesson. I thought the vibe I wanted to go with was like little tank tops. And ever since I've tried on all the ones I've received, I just don't have the facilities for it. You know, I don't have, let's be straight up, the boobs, the baggage, and they don't look great on me, but We'll see what we can do. Also, I do have a huge pile of things I will be returning. And I'm gonna go try to return them tonight before I leave for Coachella. Oh, it's Thursday, by the way. I leave for Coachella tonight at 9 p.m. So, you know, we're doing what we can. We got another tank top, but pretty crazy. It has shells going down the middle. Interesting. So, so far I have six outfit options that I would survive in. Like I don't absolutely hate. I just haven't really figured out which ones are my favorite, but I think I'm gonna bring them all to Coachella and then just 
wear what makes me feel the most confident that day. All right, we got another tank top that I don't got the facilities for. Some of these pieces, I don't know what I was thinking. I wanted to like be adventurous and try things that I wouldn't normally try, but honestly, I wouldn't normally try these things for a reason. So I should have just stuck with what I know. We got another little tank top. Today's been crazy. I've been tanning every day the last couple of days because I'm trying to already have a tan when I get there so I don't hate myself. And bad thing is today, I went a little too hard and roasted my body. Like I can't show you, but I have welts. You'll see when I try to close. I have welts up here right now on my arms, the tops of my feet and my legs because I'm burnt. And I put on sunscreen, but I put on like tanning sunscreen. So lesson learned. So hopefully I'm not super uncomfortable all week with my sunburn. This is a skirt. I don't know what this thing is for, but this is a skirt that matches the one tank top. Interesting. Last piece. I really hope this fits because I've been looking forward to it. Leopard pants, big baggy jeans. And imagine it just like with a little black top, fire. Okay, I say we try some of these pieces on because you guys haven't really gotten a look at that yet. And then I will also show you guys the outfits I have already decided on, which are all these ones back here. And I need to put all this shit away. Let's get into it. I'm keeping it so real with you guys right now. These welts are actually terrible. I hope that you can see them on camera, but they are pretty painful too. I'm not gonna lie, I'm trying to play it cool, but I'm actually a little bit stressed about that. I hope they calm down. I don't know how that works. All right, this is a top as expected. I don't like it, but the pants are cool. And this was like not intended to be together. I'm just like showing you guys the pieces, but these are the leopard pants, which actually fit really well. They're like low waisted. I maybe think I won't end up wearing these to Coachella just because I already have better outfits picked out, but I do like them. I think I'll bring them just in case we do something at night where I really need some pants and I'm definitely gonna keep them regardless of my daily life, but the shirt is getting returned. All right guys, this is the two piece set of the skirt and the tank top. I tried to pair it with some jewelry to get more of a look of what it is like because Coachella is all about the jewels and jewelry and I feel like I like it. Yeah, this look is actually fire. I am so burnt, I'm so upset, but I actually really like this. Like this could be an option that I bring for sure. Okay guys, this is the next outfit, which is this Princess Polly top and Urban Outfitter skirt. And then I'm gonna be wearing it with this belt like this and then the brown boots from 12th Tribe. All the rest of the outfits I have picked out I already know I'm gonna go with, so I'm just gonna show you guys all of those because some of the rest of the items did not work out. I tried on everything else from that store and I couldn't even show you because they didn't fit. I broke one top, the other one, lots of things were showing and it just didn't go well. So I'm gonna show you guys all the outfit options I have and then I'm gonna start packing. This is another fun little option. The shirt is from House of CB and ties in the back. And then the skirt is from Dolls Kill. This is kind of like my colorful option super fun the skirt moves really nice and yeah i like that one this next one is a skirt from urban outfitters a hat from 12th tribe and a top from zara this one is also a really cute outfit i feel like i would probably style it differently with like jewelry and everything and i would also wear a belt on here like this but i think that is also really really cute like hello here is the next one, which is a top from... The top is Princess Polly, bottoms is Urban, and it looks like this. It's like these micro shorts and this flowy top, and I was thinking of wearing it with this, and obviously the brown boots. So far, all these outfits are with the brown boots. I just don't really have many other great options, but I think that all of that is cute. We do have seven outfit options for three days, but it's better to have more than less, so let's try on the last one. We actually have one more after this, and I might style this differently as said, but I think this is my favorite outfit. It's gonna be with the red boots and the red belt, and then when I tried it on, I just wore pasties under it, not a white bikini top, so I'll see how I feel day of. But this is this look I really, really like. It's like a low-waisted skirt. I love this one. I think I'm gonna wear this on Friday because I think that's like the most important day. We actually have one more. Okay, so this is the final outfit, which I do think is very cute. I have the red boots on, which I don't think I should, but those are for the last outfit too. Red hat and a little white dress. This could be a really cute Sunday outfit, but there's so many good options. So we'll have to see. And then also I am bringing like three different types of pasties 
black and white shorts to go under my outfits or a white swim bottom depending because everything is super short so in case I feel like I need to wear something underneath I have all these options and then I'm also going to bring some swimsuit options because our Airbnb has a pool and I'm also going to an event that's a pool party so I have these three swimsuits we're also going to a neon night so I might need to utilize this three of these yeah that's pretty much everything so here are the clothes I'm bringing we have the hats the boots and all the jewelry and now it's time to start packing because I'm like leaving in a couple hours. All right guys, all the clothes that I showed you and my hair and makeup stuff I put in my suitcase. I didn't film it for the YouTube video because I filmed that for TikTok. So now it is currently 8.40. Vince just went to get his hair cut. His friend um, owns a barber shop. So he went to go get his hair cut. Our plan is to leave at 10 now. Like I said, I'm all packed up. So I am going to sit down and do as much school filming, edit editing, like check emails and all that before we leave. Sorry I didn't vlog last night, but I was having a lot of back pain and throat hurts and I just didn't finish this vlog. So I'm just gonna end it here. It was really short, but I'm gonna have more content from all of this on Snapchat, TikTok, Instagram, literally everything else. We just woke up and people are sleeping, so that's why I'm whispering. But I'm laying out my stuff. It's Friday, it's Coachella day one. So come back for the Coachella vlog. Three.